You're watching 8-Bit Days a Week, and I'm gonna be playing um, a really classic shooter, Shoot 'em Up. I seem to be saying that all the time, but I definitely know this is like a pre-arcade crash era. And you may be familiar with the Famicom version, maybe? Yeah, this is Star Force. I uh, specifically remember if you know Starcade, the TV show, I know they were playing this. So. Yeah, just a long time ago. This is actually one of the... I think this is the game that uh, oh, got me into shoot 'em ups <laughs> It had a perfect uh, control actually. Yeah, rate of fire. Alpha. And yeah, as I said, if it weren't for this game, I probably be not into uh, vertical shoot em ups as much. It's uh, really this game that made me enjoy what it is, what the genre is at least. So, a very important game in my life. I'm uh, actually confused with how this uh, series went because I know there's uh, like a sequel but it was done by a different company uh, Super Star Force and then if you look at the Caravan trilogy that uh, got released on the SNES I mean Super Famicom this game is uh, included with Hector and uh, wait, what was the other game again? Was it Super Star Force indeed? It's Hector and another one. And um, anyway, the thing is, it became uh, like part of the Caravan games, which actually consisted of uh, the Soldier games, as far as I know. Yeah, Star Soldier and I think that was the other game in the Caravan Trilogy. Of course, Star Soldier had also Soldier Blade and Final Soldier as a sequel. What happens if I miss that? Oh, just the bonus. Okay. Which uh, seems to be completely different from... Uh, this one. So it seems like from this game it uh, branched out into two series. The Soldier series and um, a, S a Star Force series. Anyway, I don't have the f full story. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, yeah, should be it for this video.
This is Star Force, and you're watching it with Days a Week. I definitely recommend this. Well, for me, at least because it has the nostalgic value. Anyway, it's a small game. Go ahead, load it. And you have to start with the. I wouldn't say basic, but this is a good starting point, I would say. To get a feel on how vertical shooters should go. Alright, please like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching.